Hey stars! Welcome to another video. I am Starry, Lord of Stars. And this is another World War Z video which I haven't done in a while. It's just an update video, it's not really a gameplay. And first things first, join Star Community. You can see a card at the first second. Uh, it's actually a way to help you join because, you know, we have a lot of things. Roles, members, servers and memes. But we also have a verification system. That video helps you to verify and get in. And our growth has been wonderful. I'm kidding. We're, we're still inactive and I'm still kind of... Uh, just passively using it, but it's helpful if you want to talk to me or play with us because we do that sometimes, yes. And also, I made a video on this video um, on World War Z, I mean, on, on the document hunting. And this is essentially just kind of like a follow through video. Also, yeah, I. St EMOTIONAL DAMAGE! And even though I can't make every day, I, I at least once every few days, you know, that's... I believe it was here. Yeah, on the 20th of December, so it's been like two months, two and a half, almost. And in that video, I discussed statistics, so... Um, I even have this here, which uh, basically shows you the amount of time you played stuff for World War Z is 2000 and that video was 1.7k so 2k hours that's a lot of hours and it even shows all this stuff like I found this new game that's nice yeah uh, it's just like a I guess it just tells you stuff but yeah in, in epic itself oh yeah by the way I have a lot of free games uh, that are paid games that epic gives away for free so you can see this is the library I have and you can see a lot of games here but the thing is I can't play a lot of them because of um, you know even scrolling is what the dog doing I didn't even bother downloading them because I don't think I can even play them uh, also there's some games I want to but I just feel like maybe I will make video on them future and I will play at that time you know something like that that's mostly why I haven't played all of them yet but I like the new update. It's it's uh, with Epic Games. It's it's a bit likable and also a bit not because like now all the pictures are visible, but now you you won't know which one is the ones you install. Maybe I should go up and sort so that it's installed separately. Like you know what I mean? Ah yes, my favorite. <laughs> okay. There we are. Finally, W. Okay, so there's more, uh, wow, the options bar takes forever to load. Imagine playing, this is the problem, actually trying to play, if I am, I can't imagine the game actually running. Okay, to recap, in the last video, I was telling you about how to make, uh, how the document system works. Essentially, if you go into any challenges, okay, so to get documents which are like papers in the game, uh, you need to play challenge modes, any of them, uh, and you will find them in the levels and secret places that are fixed, I believe 9 to 11 of them, I don't know, it could be different, I'm not sure, but they have at least one spawn for sure, and you can only take one at a time, so... If you take it and die, by the way, unlike unlike the virus sample, it doesn't matter. If your team wins, you still have the document and you get it. So you, you don't even need to stay alive for it. As long as you take the document and die first, of course. Uh, your team can't carry it for you, only you can take it. And you can take it even if you have all of them, but you can only take one at a time. And every three of them will unlock lore, which is stuff written here, and every nine of them will unlock these kinds of uh, perks, which stacks with players. So if your friends have it, then playing together increases the chance of the perks working for all of you. So you become kind of like an asset. So the thing here really is, it's not uh, as difficult in, at first if you think about it because you know it's been a while now and everyone almost knows where, what is. But I played this when the update came out, it was new. And the issue was 
and still is with the actually having the ability to get the map you need for it because let's say i finish new york and jerusalem and i want moscow i'm not going to be able to choose moscow unless it shows up here and that's the issue the issue is daily challenges are randomly spawning weekly is also random but it changes once a week and you can find documents there too but it's not the main way because it's only once a week and you only have to play it and apparently the glitch is still on because i finished it that's still not saying i finished it but anyways <laughs> in daily challenge you can see that there are three challenges here these three have different mutators which are like stuff like this which just randomly modifies the game experience generally it makes it more difficult there are easy ones too but this uh, daily challenges also do something similar they have random combinations of these mutators to make the game more difficult so that even if you choose in it's it's not going to be like even if you choose hard it's insane even if you choose normal it's hard like because of the mutators uh, basically and well this let's say let's say you wanted one map out of all these seven and you finish everything else that one map appearing the chance is less that's why it becomes harder with time and in the last video I finished only the first full and I couldn't finish the others because I didn't have the DLC and I still don't have the DLC by the way but the thing is I'm trying to contact someone for it right now uh, how did I solve it simple I just played with more people who actually had DLCs uh, and I managed to play with them with these maps when they came so the so the way it works weekly at least changes once a week daily on the other hand daily changes every few uh, every hour specifically the same minute hand it's not going to change it's always when the hand touches 12 it's just gonna respawn but depends on your time zone I guess sometimes so it's either 12 or 6 but it's always going to whatever whatever hour it's changing in it's going to stay on the same minute okay every hour so I set alarm and I just used to kept checking if my maps showed up and when they did I went into the discord server World War Z has a discord server surprise and I basically just searched DocuHunt Ops. I mean, and uh, yeah, I finished this on that day, right? <laughs> I was gonna say basically you can come here and ask people to play with you, or there's even LFG channels where you can just specifically look for which region you want. I countered the problem of DLC by talking in the Discord server, and I also had people in my server. You can see the that those who play World War Z have. A specific role called World War Z that specially I can just ping that role and say hey y'all want to play some World War Z you want to kill some zombies and if they want to we'll play and we'll join a voice channel like General Stars or we'll even go to the official server and LFG and basically we finished uh, most of the difficult uh, challenges I think I would say Kamchatka 2 is the hardest basically on the grid the weather will kill you <laughs> and and there's zombies and on top of that I need to find the document and also my you know lag and ping and all that shit so it's just extremely difficult uh, but it's more difficult in the sense that this map needs to actually show up and it hardly ever does so those are the reasons and that's how I finished it but I have actually successfully 100% finished all of the documents. It only took 100 hours, which is a lot of hours. Now I'm already in 2000 hours, I crossed 2000 hours. Uh, so if I basically just, I made a copy of it in my server as well, because you know, why not? Pretty much like a, it's, it's now like a monument at this point, like, you know, museum style stuff. I have to I had to I have an alarm that goes off and then I just check the maps in the game like I just come here and then you know what in seven minutes it's actually gonna change I could literally I still remember that because because of how much I did this uh, like two months ago oh my god the frames are crying EMOTIONAL DAMAGE But anyways, I have successfully completed it That's the update, that's that's the video, that's literally it. 1 minute 37 seconds later I have a backup file, I really like that backup file <laughs> Like, if you're playing on PC, it's really a, a huge advantage that you don't have in any other 
uh, in any other case because you know most of the time you're just playing and sometimes you want to change platform and they lose your data and then you're just like oh no because I cannot imagine like getting back to these kinds of numbers at like 2000 hours it's not something that just happens overnight it just kind of passively happens you know but the point I'm trying to make is you need to subscribe because uh, I'm making videos that can you believe that I'm making videos like real ones that shit was so retarded about to respond in another language what that see they don't know they don't know so as i was saying document hunting is done which means i only have to bother about extreme so the the way i uh hold on just one more thing the way i play weekly like when they when they show up the most efficient way right now that i see is play weekly hard uh which is 350 blue points uh, so i'm st i'm not playing world War Z much but i'm still playing the weeklies and collecting the blue points so every time it comes up it comes on a monday morning here so like i uh, i play weekly hard and then i play the dailies i need to do three it gives you 50 that's 400 and then there's also you know these two daily this is daily challenges these are daily tasks like you need two of these i think that gives you another 20 or something 50 i don't know so that's essentially like 450 and if you play three more extremes like this is i'm saying two or three hours that's it and you should get maybe 500 blue coins uh per week just by doing this there's a passive growth of blue coins like playing three hours like once a week every monday or so when it changes uh and you'll eventually be rich actually i'm planning on doing something with this like i want to just do something you'll see when i when i do it hopefully <laughs> and that's it i just wanted to make an update and say that this is done this has happened on the 11th of january 2022 i have finished document hunting which is a big deal because the update came out only like a, a while ago and i started only by december so i finished it essentially in like a month basically all the challenges after i started it because i wasn't even trying to do this whole thing and they they really focused on repetitiveness like replayability almost forcing you to at this point that's why i'm i'm i just said okay i'll just do this once a week i don't need to always do this plus i found some new games kind of plus i'm organizing my schedule and also trying to study because you know exams and stuff and i'm, I'm not trying to i have to you know have some plans so I guess that's also there so i still can't play these maps although i finished them in extreme like if you check the actual stuff i can't even show it to you but i'm actually no i can't as you can see the shiny green ticks i finished them all in extreme difficulty as well uh but winter hasn't officially arrived but I still won't be able to play on my own server and have like big ass ping issues. Actually, I feel like all the servers are bad at this point, to be honest. Singapore works okay-ish, but I mean, Europe, Singapore, both of them are like on like either sides of me. And with Middle East, there is no server locally in the Middle East here, so it's just unfortunate. Even if they had one in Africa, that would probably have the same issue as Europe and Singapore but yeah I'm gonna go I probably forgot something I'll make another video a uh, shorter one hopefully and while I can't make daily videos I can you know make frequent ones like this like I said um, have a good day everyone I hope to talk to you again uh, comment join the server have a good day level and start out <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.